Hi, I'm Tony Stefani with Hillside Christmas Tree Farm, and today we're going to apply fertilizer to that uh, problem Canaan fir field. Uh, if you've been following along, you know that we took soil samples, we kind of diagnosed some yellowing in the trees. Um, now we're going to apply the fertilizer to try to correct and get our color back and correct the soil problems that we have. Today I'm going to apply 100 pounds of phosphorus, 100 pounds of potassium, and about 400 pounds of sulfur to this area. Um, what I'm using is a pull behind drop spreader. I'll be honest, I've never used this kind before on the tractor. Um, the broadcast one that we would normally use, the PTO shaft is too long and it won't it won't reach between the and the compact tractor. Maybe if I have to keep on doing between the trees or something like that, I'll get something that'll work. But for right now, I got to do with what I got. All right, today is April 24th. Uh, you try. I want to try to get this fertilizer down a couple weeks before bud break um, because we're correcting the soils it's not that important timing wise we just got to get it in sulfur out obviously takes uh, time to kind of break down and work with the bacteria to drive that pH lower like we want it so this is gonna be a year after year project what I like about this project is that we can track it right using the videos the footage we can really see the progress if we're making any and follow this thing really uh, one thing I had to do with this spreader was add a piece of tubing so that I could reach it from the tractor to turn this thing on and off. So a little modification there. Took about 30 seconds. So yeah, let's see how it goes.
And that's how I use the drop spreader to apply the fertilizer to my problem canan fir field. Now I'll sit back and kind of see what happens over the next, uh, I don't know, several months and into the next winter. There was uh, nitrogen in some of that. It was probably a 624-24 blend that I was applying for one of them. So there was some nitrogen applied there. Um, we'll see how they grow. And in the next video, I will talk about the herbicide application, which I my dad applied maybe a few weeks before I put the fertilizer down. Well, there was a, we'll get into it, but there was a pre-emergent and some uh, glyphosate applied in bands around the trees. You can kind of already see in the uh, aerial shots that that at work. So we'll kind of go over that next on how it works. And yeah, follow along and thanks for watching. Thanks again for watching this video. I hope you saw something that will help you succeed on your farm. If you didn't, check out some of these other videos that I've created for you. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already so you don't miss out on any future content. Lastly, if you'd like to support the channel, please consider us using the Buy Me A Coffee or affiliate links in the description below.